Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Well, today I'm showing you the stuff I got uh, from Back to the Future. There was supposed to be a custom that I was going to wear for Halloween, uh, uh, this past Al Halloween of 2013. But, unfortunately it got late and I never, I never got to wear it. But, I finally got myself my own Marty Butterfly holographic hat. The one I showed you before was for a client and I loved it so much that I said I needed it to have. I also got myself uh, the Safe to Clock to the Tower printout. Uh, I, all I did was download the, uh, the brochure, the picture of the brochure, and then I printed out in a blue paper which is exactly what it came on the movie. And then I got the shirt it's a shirt that simulates the what Marty McFly was wearing in Back to the Future, the first movie. So I'm going to show you in detail, just in a minute. Alright, as you can see, the shirt, it still has the, the dye sublimated print sticker, which is a sticker that tells you what it is. It says the dye sub sublimation printing process creates light imperfections that are unique to and part of each garment so HT is unique so there you go this is how this looks it looks like either part of the blue jean guest jacket that Marty was wearing on the first part and you can also see here uh, some of that jacket folding then you see the what they say all the time in the movie that he was wearing a lifesaver but actually it's just a regular snow jacket that he had and which I got by the way and there in the bag you can see the square shirt that he used it has squares on it and it was black and white and then the shirt that was behind that shirt which was a red shirt so all in that it simulates exactly what he was wearing on the first movie. Now let me show the back. So this is how it looks on the back. And then again it simulates the whole thing like if you were wearing it, the real stuff. So actually I thought it was pretty cool. When you see it from far away it actually looks like you're wearing that stuff. Uh, I, I, I kinda liked it. I got it off from eBay and it was not it was not that bad. Uh, the service was a little bit slow. It got here a little bit slow. It got it, it took like almost two weeks to get where I'm at. But um, overall, I'm happy. I'm very satisfied with it. And uh, if you want a quick disguise as Marty McFly, you can wear that. So as you can see, it's very cool. And you also have the Back to the Future logo and trademark copyright for the shirt which is really cool and you, you also can see part of the jeans that he was wearing so see it's like it gives you like a 3D effect so it's actually pretty pretty cool I haven't worn it yet because like I said it was supposed to be for Halloween but I'm going to show you now the jacket I got um, from uh, the, this uh, red jacket that he wore on the movie on the first movie Okay, now you're actually watching at the real jacket. I got this at JCPenney. It's brand new. Uh, it was amazing because I was just passing by and then all of a sudden I see the jacket. It was too much of a coincidence and I couldn't skip it. But when I saw it at first glance, I thought it was like probably what? A lot of money. But it ended up, it was on sale and it was really, really affordable, guys. I couldn't skip it. Why am I showing you all this? Because I've all of a sudden decided that I want to collect um, Back to the Future stuff. I love the movie. I got the movie as well. I'll show you in a minute. Uh, I watch the movies and I fall in love again with 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 all the concept of the movie. Uh, the movie was was as all as you know if you're a fan. The movie was done in the mid '80s and that time. Oh, what are those days when when I saw that movie? I, I was just a kid, like, younger than the Michael J. Fox, so it was kind of cool uh, watching that movie again from a long time, because the last time I saw that movie was in the theaters, actually. So, <laughs> I, 
I love it. I, I fell in love with it, and I thought it was really neat to have, you know, the things that he wore on the movie. Uh, this is not exactly uh, the same jacket that he wore, but it's very, very close. You can see it's very well done. It has um, inner side pockets. It's kind of like a khaki color in the inside, but it's really nice. Had pockets on the front. Uh, I think he had pockets on the front, but they were a little bit different from that. Uh, but overall, it kind of looks like it. So I really, really, I'm really satisfied with the jacket. So now I'm gonna, I'm off to show you my last prop for the movie. See, this is the the trilogy, the complete trilogy of Back to the Future. This is presented by Steven Spielberg and directed by Robert Zemeckis. Zemeckis? I hope I said that right. And um, this I got it off from eBay. It was only twelve dollars plus um, was shipping included, and uh, I couldn't believe in the conditions this movie were. They're excellent. There's not even one little scratch on the movie. It looked like the person that had it just look look at the movie once and that's it. They never touch it any, any, anymore. So I'm very happy with the purchase. Probably in the future I'll get um, the Blu-ray collection. Uh, because I think it's, it's it's you know the quality is much better. But so far I'm very happy. I've seen it already twice. I'm I'm, very, I'm so in love with the movie. It's not even funny. It kind of it it kind of went back to my you know younger years and and it's part of life that I grew up with. And I thought it was really neat. Then again, to get some of these props so I can have them and you know show them and and enjoy them so thank you so much for watching I hope you really like um, my update on the back to the future things and hopefully um, you will see more of these uh, props soon uh, I'm, I'm planning to get more of these props um, in the near future and uh, you can always check it out for me and check out for me on the YouTube channel so if you like what you see please rate, comment and subscribe and Thanks for watching. Bye.